Check it out. Yeah. I mean, obviously, yeah. we'll take care of the the movie, make sure that it's good. And, but but really, a cast that was just different. So is it horror, western, uh, zombie musical? So what? No, well, it's not a musical. It's 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 a um, an action horror western post apocalyptic movie. So imagine um, it's kind of we're in the creative process right now. But imagine it being sort of like a little bit of a uh, 50 years after the apocalypse. There's a zombie apocalypse. There's a town that is actually um, being controlled by a shaman and he uses zombies to actually control the people and and so um, an outside source actually hires seven bandits which are the dead seven to actually come and take take care of the uh, town so then Lauren you come into this as one of the one, one of the dead seven. bandits one of the yes. dead seven. yeah so talk about your character um, the character is still in development, but I know that I wear um, just as little as possible clothing. <laughs> there may or may not be a makeup scene with someone in NC. I'm trying not. I'm trying to change it. I really think he was like he just woke bad. up one morning and wrote down a dream he had. <laughs> We're sick and twisted. Trust me, entertainers don't listen. Um, no. Um, yeah, so, it, so you're changing that? Is that what you're saying? There's, there's, yeah, like, we're rewriting a lot of things because it was originally set, the original script, Dead West, was set actually in the past, so in the actual Wild West. Like right. the 1800s. So when we brought it to, um, to, no, no, to Asylum, they suggested that maybe we make it a little bit more current, you know, for our fan base. And so these are the things we're in, the, in development mode. And so her character is, you know, she's sort of, I mean, she's a great actress. She trained under Howard Fine in Los Angeles. And, and so really, you know, it's just going to be great to work with my wife. And that's one of the things that we've always wanted to do. Yeah. Now, is it uh, in that campy vein of Sharknado because you're working with the Asylum? A little bit. I mean, there's definitely going to be some campiness to it. I mean, you think about boy banders. You think about the boy banders. Yeah, it's going to be campy to a certain degree, but at the same time, I mean, we're taking it serious. I mean, we are we are seven, you know, action bandits that are trying to save a town from zombies. I mean, i got to take it pretty serious. Right? We no, have to. We have to save the town. We have to save the future that's already over. So, no. Man. <laughs> but no, it's. Um, I mean, it's like I said, everything is sort of development. 
So, so the, the action hero, the superhero, superhero, but we are here at Comic Con. Do you have like a favorite superhero that you definitely look up to? Yeah. With this role, can you show us your superhero poses? <laughs> let's go. Yeah. Let's go there. Actually, I just take a guess. Who is this? This is Bane. No. Well, I'm trying to do a little Batman here, but okay. I can't. Oh, <laughs> I think little her and I are both back in. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So I like Blood Rain. You know who Blood Rain is? She's like a main pirate. Who's a rocket suit? game. Is she Marvel? No, no. Blood Rain. I think she's just separate. Oh. So let's do a superhero pose on her. So, okay. Right. Because she's actually the badass character in the movie. She's like the strong, you know, almost like Charlize Theron in yeah. Mad Max type of character. So, 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 so yeah. <laughs> I can't take it seriously. <laughs> Come on, man, focus. I can't focus. I gotta be an actor here, right? Okay, hold on. Hold on. Ready? Ready? Uh, that was the that was Bruce Dio. Like, <laughs> like Mortal Kombat right here. That's see, that's my favorite. Our favorite Mortal Kombat. And yeah, she always so Katana. plays Katana. And he's Scorpion. Right? <laughs> she could bench press me. With All those years ago, did you think that we would be standing here at Comic Con talking about one of the No, actually, I, I I mean I had dreams and aspirations and things you know outside of what I do as a musician, but um, you know it's this has taken a long time and it's you know it's finally coming to fruition and you know it, it's a dream come true I mean we still have to film the movie and we still have to get there and we're putting together the cast but it's on its way and we're, we are we're at Comic Con and sitting here with you with your Star Wars shirt on which we're, we're actually watching right now you're watching right now 1977 Star Wars we're watching the original and then we're going to go back and do the, the series so you're looking for a cast if there's anything that I can uh, fulfill or help out with yeah you know you, you, you can easily ass. be a zombie. I can, be an, I can get my ass kicked. Uh, you can easily be a zombie. You can easily be a zombie. Yeah. <laughs> That's what you should have. Look for the, now it's, okay, give me auditioning time. Okay. Give me your best zombie. You gotta say something too. You gotta give me something. Oh yeah, we gotta take him to the bathroom. I think it's complicated. I think it's complicated. Thank you guys. It's great to see you. Thank you. Mike, get a photo. Yeah, yeah. Rick, get a photo. Oh, you want me in that chair? Sure, of course. Now give me your best song. Yeah. What is that? Thank you so much. Really hey man, good to see you. Dude. Seriously, it's awesome. Awesome to see. It's been too long. I know, man. How's everything going? We're going to live in I just what I was gonna, I was gonna say. <laughs> Are you in LA? Sometimes, yeah. Yeah, the vacation, the new reboot. Yes, let's take Nick in ages, and I used to see him on like a regular two month basis all those years ago, like close to 18, 17 years ago. So that's really, really cool. He's got a film at Comic Con. Well, it's in development, he's acting now, he's looking better than ever. Seriously, he looks great. He looks great. But uh, man, now we've got AJ and uh, Joey coming up. Uh, this is like good old days, all these memories, all these memories right now. It's like, Oh. When was the first time you met them? Do you remember when was the first time? The first time I met him? It was a very long time ago. It was like 97, I would say. 
they were first starting out in the Quebec area, and then they came into where I worked close to 20 years ago. It really was. And it was like, these, there were girls screaming everywhere. It was a madhouse. I couldn't concentrate because I it was just screams in my ears. And I'm trying to interview these guys. And I remember they did on the spot. All five of them did like an acapella song. It was beautiful. I should have got them to do acapella with Lauren. So that's not his wife? I'm confused. Your your fans they've been they said we want more Rick yes we do.